Welcome everyone, welcome to Let's Play This War of Mine, The Little Ones. Well, I've already played this War of Mine a couple times, um, but now I've decided to come back to the game because there was such a, um, well, such a response to uh, me showing the, uh, the Little Ones DLC and people were saying, please play the game again. So, well, why not? Here's some fan service, and I like the game anyway. So let's let's do another try. Let's, um, you know, oh, well, I've I've shown you the uh, Arika, Ivano, and Henrik with this little kid, um, but maybe we should, yeah, take a different kid. Marco, just one. Oh, Zlata, Emilia, and Kalina. Hmm. Well, that's not going to be that useful. I mean. Arika is it's at least, uh, you know, quick. Wow, there's four of them here, and I've survived with that one. <laughs> of course, because it's four of them. Um, this one would be good. Boris. Boris is awesome for scavenging. He's got so much space, it's awesome. Anyway, um... I don't know. Arika, Ivano, Henrik. Zlata, Emilia, Kalina. I can't remember who they are. Zlata... Who is Zlata? Is that Zlata? It might be. Emilia. I don't remember Emilia. Well, let's try it. You will lose your current progress. Yes, I am sure. And it's probably going to start us uh, with winter or something. I'm guessing. No, not winter. That's fine. Alright, so there's our house. This is the alternative uh, shelter, I believe. So that certainly not happened in my uh, in my let's play yet. There's a kid. I think this is the alternative shelter. I can't remember. It's been so long. All right. The relentless bombardment has, redu has reduced this part of the besieged city, city to ruins. Snipers hunt for survivors, making daytime trips in search of water and food a deadly game. The local community responded by pulling together with stubborn perseverance. Sadly, some people turned to stealing and worse. Zlata, a student at the music academy, lost her parents after the evacuation of her younger brother. She took Emilia, a lone survivor, under her wig. Together, they decided to shelter in an abandoned house and hope for the best. Despite their difficult situation, they agreed to look after a young girl named Kalina, while her older brother went to seek aid outside the city. Okay, so we've got an old girl. Oh, she's already sick. Well, let's start doing the rubble. Uh, let's go up here. So both are slightly sick. Bolster spirits, talented lawyer, and war orphan. And she's sad. She needs, she needs to be spoken to or played with. Let's open the doors. What are you doing, Zlata? You don't have time, do you? Well, let's let's make her happy. Do you want to play a clapping game? Sure. Oh, that's nice. And now they're doing the clapping game. That's pretty cool. Uh, we got some water. Well, just a little bit. Not much. We're lucky it's not cold in here. What, what do we have here? That was fun, Kalina. Hopefully she'll feel better. Yeah, let's try it again tomorrow. Okay, we'll have her play a little bit. And uh, hopefully it'll, you know, make her feel better. Oh, we do have some food here. That's good. Alright, now you can go and play. And we'll check out the other things. Children have it hardest in war. We also need to go down, uh, down there. This is going to be locked. That's as per usual. This is probably going to be locked as well. Um, and these doors are probably... Well, that door is probably going to be, be locked as well. And these will need lock -taking. So, we've pretty much found everything we can, unfortunately. It's only one food. That is not a lot. Mm. There's also stuff over there. So, hopefully that will have something of use. Uh, unfortunately, the kids, I don't think, can really do anything, as far as rubble goes. Um, let's also read their biographies. 
I was just accepted to the music academy when the war broke out. I had so many plans. I had dreams. I used to play the guitar, date boys, dance. My little brother today always made me smile. It all seems like a dream now. Replaced by this nightmare we live in. Yet, I still hope one day we can forget the war and carry on with our lives as if it had never happened. What does Emilia say? Now that we're stuck together, I might as well tell you about me and my family. Father was a, pra a very practical man. He always reminded us of the importance of financial safety. That's why I became a lawyer like him, and my sister was to become a doctor. When the war broke out, we had lots of sa a lot of savings on our family account, but the currency soon, l soon lost all value, the banks were closed, and we had no foreign cash. In a matter of days, we became poor. And Kalina? Hello, my name is Kalina. What's your name? We can be friends. I don't have many friends now that everyone is fighting. Only my brother. He is my best friend. He looks after me and says everything will be alright. He went to look for our uncle who will come for us and take us far away from the angry people who fight each other. And then mommy and daddy will come back. Oh. I guess... Well, yeah, she's a war orphan, so... Mommy and daddy will not come back. Where do I sleep? Yeah, we'll need to make some beds, but first of all, let me see if she can actually uh, do anything with the rubble. No, let's embark on a journey to the other side of this pile of rubble. Well, not really. Because she can't do anything. Um, well, play with the other things. She, she's, she's not sad anymore, so that's good. So I'm guessing that's cl uh, locked. Yep. I could force the lock if I only had tools. Go check that thing out. Ah, damn it. Okay, so, open that, and you go and check that. Now, the reason I'm trying to hurry is because we obviously, you know, have about half a day left, and I want to do this quickly, because we still need to uh, do some things. Well, I can... Oh, that's not locked. Excellent. Oh, very nice. All right, go and... Oh, these are all need to be lockpicked. That's annoying. Well... Go and lockpick it, I guess. Actually, no, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. We're gonna lockpick this one here. Here. Because with that one, we don't get anything because we still need another pick lock. Slightly sick. That's not good. Alright, so first of all, we need beds. Offer uh, Offers a decent sleep without back pain, no matter if it's night or day. Uh, we're gonna put beds here. One here. And we'll need another one. Oh, some medicine. That's not bad. We're not going to use medicine uh, for being slightly sick. That's definitely not an option. But yeah, well, first of all, we're gonna make rich man, poor man, beggar man, thief, doctor, lawyer, Indian chief. Huh. Uh, yeah, we're going to clear this. We're going to make another bed and then some other stuff. We need some water, some water collector. Uh, we'll also need filters. Can she play with anything else? She's already play. Oh, she can play up there. There we go. Alright. Let's see. We obviously need one more bed. Uh, so let's see. We'll need the rainwater collector. I should probably just make that right away, but we need the stove as well. So let's make the rainwater collector. Uh, well, no, that's where the... Hmm. Well, let's make it down here, next to the uh, workshop, because this is where we'll be making filters anyway, so it's going to be quick, you know, going back and forth. And she can draw a little bit. That's good. Alright, well, time is running out. We need another bed. Of course, we can just make one the next day, but right now... I don't know, you know, how the whole uh, issue with looters is right now. Do we have any filters? I don't think we do, no. I need to make a filter. I feel ill. Well, I can make a filter, but right now we need to make another bed. So it's gonna be just enough to make a bed and a filter. Let's do that. That rubble is almost done. There we go. Make the filter, wait for the rubble to complete. I mean, 
to get cleared and now we can just make that bed quickly over here and then not go there oops get the filter and she will make the bed all right i've got a nasty headache well the thing is i really need to go out scavenging because we only have two um two food over here uh but they are slightly sick which is not really ideal so there we go that's the that's the water being made <laughs> You want to call it that way. I also need the stove, but hopefully I'll get ten components and uh, some extra wood on this run. This is, I assume, locked. There we go. That's done. Yeah, that's locked. That sucks. Okay, you guys can just lie down. There's nothing else we can really do. Um, but as I said, one of them will have to go and loot. And I'm guessing it's gonna be Emilia. Because Zlata is pretty good at um, talking to people, so... Unless Emilia has less space than Zlata, uh, it's going to be her. Are there rats living here? Well, hopefully not. Well, actually, hopefully yes, so we can catch them and eat them. Where are you going? How do you open it? Do you need a magic word? No, it's already open. There we go, we're done. I could have just clicked end day, but... By the way, thank you f so much if you're uh, turning off... Oh, Zlata has more. Uh, okay, so she's gonna sleep in bed, and she's gonna sleep in bed. Uh, and you're gonna scavenge. Looted gas station. Yeah, thank you so much if you're turning off your ad blocker. It really does help me um, immensely. This was one of the very first places people looted while fleeing from the city. There had been a few hour-long ceasefire intended to clean the whole area from civilians, but it was broken. Many people died, though neither side claimed responsibility to this day. Despite a heavy shelling of the whole district, the station is in a surprisingly decent shape. It may have been looted, but it might still be worth to check it out. Some food, huge amount of materials, lots of parts. Hmm. There's a quiet house. It's in a housing estate that remains almost untouched. It's a calm area of little houses with porches and gardens. Most of these houses are still inhabited. People are trying to lead normal lives there. We've got nothing to look for there unless we're willing to steal. And St. Mary's Church. St. Mary's Church is still a place of, for meetings for the local community. Priest Olek is known for his charitable work and offering refuge to the poor. He might have something to give away or trade. The vestry behind the church is devastated and abandoned. We could find some useful materials there. Well, let's go to the gas station first. I don't remember the gas station. Damn, I would really need, um, Boris. He has so much space. Looks like people had drained it dry since it didn't blow up after the shelling. Drained it dry. Well, there we go. There's the, um, broken toy. Okay, so we need... We need parts. Components. I don't remember this place. It's pretty cool. There we go. Lovely. I really need a lot of them. I'm going to be leaving the uh, toys behind right now, probably. Aw, oh, damn. There's rubble here. What? Can you get up? Oh, there we go. That's pretty cool. So we don't have to deal with the rubble. Oh, that's probably a rat. Hopefully. Alright, so let's see. I'm leaving this behind. I'm leaving this behind for now. Because I just need these parts. And I need lots of them. Uh, books. I'm gonna leave here for now. Probably. Uh-oh. That must be people. Uh, it's boarded up. Interesting. There must be people in there. Now the question is, do I want to actually go down there? Might be interesting. Very nice. Uh, roll up cigarettes. I'm actually going to leave those behind as well. Okay, let's be careful here. Hmm, could be just rest. This poor man had been caught by the shelling. What was he doing here? Could be just rest. Oh, nice. Look at this. I can't see over there. So let's see what else we have. Uh oh, it's coming up the stairs. Whatever it is. Right, let's make an escape route first. 
Well, if there were people over here, they would have heard this, I think, so they would have come to investigate, and because they're not, I'm guessing they're just rats. Yeah, they're just rats. Alright. Yep, rats it is. Alright. Usually the first area you can scavenge... Wow, that's lots of stuff. Uh, it doesn't have danger anyway. Oh, I won't open, so I have to go from the other side. Anything here? No, there's something. Now, the reason I'm, why I'm doing this is because I won't really get any bonus stuff for, you know, doing this quickly. I have a set amount of time I can be here, and if I can do more stuff and check it out if it's worth coming back to, which of course it is right now, um, you know, I won't have to do it next time. So right now, I'm going to clear all this rubble. Um, because, well, because I have time. I've already gotten what I wanted. And considering this is behind rubble, it probably will have something pretty good. And there's a grate there. So we'll, we'll need some, uh, we'll need a saw to get through. She's slightly sick and content. Well, I hope they don't, um, get sicker. And also, I didn't put anyone on watch back home. So, uh, if there are looters going around, I'll be sorry. <laughs> Come on with that rubble. Look at that. She's bloody, uh, she's bloody strong, moving all that stuff around. Oh, excuse me. I just wish there was some kind of, um, some kind of a way to make backpacks or something, you know, to make more inventory space available, available because there's all this stuff and they never really have, um, space for it. Am I bringing... Oh, yeah, I'm bringing the fertilizer. Which might not be the, the best idea right now, because it's only... You know, I usually only use it for traps, not even for growing plants, but... I don't know, maybe I should leave it behind and get the really important stuff. Oh. Wait, didn't I leave all this stuff behind? That's odd. It's almost exactly the same as before. Of course, we gotta be careful that we do uh, come back before time runs out. Uh, because if we don't, you can get all sorts of negative stuff. There is a note under the table, not actually hidden, but it could be easily missed. From the style of handwriting, you can tell it was written by a woman, in a hurry. Milos, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I could not wait any longer. I hid some jewelry inside the books. Look for them in the basement, inside carton boxes behind the barn door. Use it. Stay alive. Please. God bless you. I'm sorry. Well, we need a we need a saw to get through there. So, oh, oh, ho, 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 ho. I am taking that and herbal meds. I need more wood as well. That's not going to be good. I have all this stuff, but not much wood. Well, I'm definitely coming back to this place. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to get some wood instead. Yeah, yeah, make you know. I know what you're gonna say. Ha ha ha, you're gonna get wood. Ha ha ha. Go on then, flush your system. <laughs> get it out of your system. Alright, so, some extra wood. Oh, bloody hell. Yes, please. And loads of water here as well. Wow. I'm definitely coming back for this. Well, let's run to the exit. There's not much we can do right here anymore because we're full. Look at that rat. I wish you could place down traps here and, um, you know, and come back to uh, get the rats. That would be nice. Anyway, thank you for watching, and we're going to continue next time.